ओके इन टूडेज पांडास क्लास वी विल ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड डाटा फ्रेम ओके इन द प्रीवियस क्लास आई टोल यू द डाटा फ्रेम इट इज जस्ट लाइक ए टू डायमेंशनल डाटा स्ट्रक्चर मीन्स ए टू डायमेंशनल अरे अरे इज वर्ड ऑलरेडी आई टोल यू दैट अरे मीन्स अरे विल होल्ड मल्टीपल वैल्यूज ओके मल्टीपल वैल्यूज मीन्स वन वैरिएबल कैन होल्ड ओनली वन वैल्यू एनी टाइप ऑफ डाटा इंटीजर फ्लोट कैर स्ट्रिंग एनी टाइप ऑफ डाटा बट इफ यू वॉन्ट टू स्टोर मल्टीपल वैल्यूज इन ए वैरिएबल सो वी नीड टू क्रिएट एन अरे इन पैथान देर इज नो एनी अरे लिस्ट विल बी कंसिडर एज अरे पैथान में लिस्ट को ही अरे कंसिडर करते हैं अरे मीन्स बहुत सारे वैल्यू को स्टोर करते हैं अरे के अंदर वही लिस्ट है जैसे कि एक लिस्ट के अंदर फ्लोट भी हो सकता है इंटीजर भी हो सकता है स्ट्रिंग हो सकते हैं एंड कॉम्प्लेक्स नंबर हो सकते हैं सो टू डायमेंशनल अरे मीन्स अरे के अंदर और एक अरे है सो इसलिए टू एक सिंगल अरे है तो उसको सिंगल डायमेंशनल अरे बोलते हैं इफ देर इज ए अरे हैज़ वन मोर अरे अरे इन अरे इट इज़ कॉल्ड टू डायमेंशनल अरे इफ देर इज ओनली वन अरे इट इज़ कॉल्ड अरे मीन्स लिस्ट ना सो इट इज़ कॉल्ड सिंगल डायमेंशनल अरे ओके सो डाटा फ्रेम इज कॉल्ड ए टू डायमेंशनल डाटा स्ट्रक्चर डाटा स्ट्रक्चर्स मीन्स अरेज अरे लिस्ट लिंक लिस्ट ओके ट्री ग्राफ दीज आर ऑल डाटा स्ट्रक्चर्स अरेज अरे लिस्ट लिंक लिस्ट ट्री ग्राफ क्यू दीज आर ऑल डाटा स्ट्रक्चर्स ओके दे विल यू कैन स्टडी दम ऑल इन यूर डाटा स्ट्रक्चर्स इन अलगा रिदम्स सो डाटा फ्रेम इज वॉट इट इज जस्ट लाइक ए टेबल विथ रोज एंड कॉलम्स ओके सो डाटा फ्रेम इज ए टू डायमेंशनल अरे विथ एट रोज एंड कॉलम्स ओके इट इज हैविंग टेबल सो एज आई टोल यू दैट डाटा फ्रेम इज ए टू डायमेंशनल डाटा स्ट्रक्चर आर कॉल्ड अरे अरे इज एन एग्जांपल ऑफ डाटा स्ट्रक्चर so it can be called as a table with rows and columns okay data frame ek table hai uske andar rows and columns hote hain theek hai aapko maine bataya tha jab bhi maine sql padha raha tha whenever i was teaching sql <coughs> that moment i told you that database is nothing but it is having so many tables so at least a database must have one table so data database means database always having more than one table table means data stored in columns and rows so i told you that so many um languages are there as sql mysql these are called ms access uh, oracle postgresql okay mongo db mongo db means uh, no sql okay no sql these are all uh, what uh, these are all used to create the databases okay so here see how to create a simple pandas data frame so first of all we need to import pandas pandas uh, is a library i told you that how to install it so as pd means uh, alias we can use another name nickname for pandas library pd not compulsory pd you you keep your name my name x y z any okay so that no need to call again pandas pandas we can call pd so now data is a variable that variable assigned with a data set why data set try to understand here data set is why in python whenever we were studying about uh, sets dictionaries tuples and uh, lists that moment i told you that lists always will be in square brackets calories is a list okay data is uh, 
integer data stored in square brackets so calories is a list list name is calories duration is a list because duration is list name and um, 50 40 45 elements integer elements value stored in square brackets so two arrays two lists mean two arrays are there so now it is why two dimensional two arrays are there i told you that single dimensional array means only one list is there two dimensional array means two lists are there okay why it is data set set is always declared in flower braces but the dictionary also will be declared in flower braces but dictionary and set both will be declared in flower braces but difference is that dictionary declared in flower braces with key value pairs okay one key is there it is paired with a value that is the difference okay so now it is a data set because data is kept in list two lists are kept in your flower braces so it is a data set so how to create a data frame from this data set let us see now comment hash means in python hash indicating that comments means that line of code will not be executed by read by your python interpreter load data into a data frame object so this line of code will not be read by your python interpreter now def is an object okay so now the data this data d data data okay that is a variable you can keep change this name okay i will show df is an object now this data is load into this data frame object okay object created now df is equal pd pd alias name pandas dot data frame bracket that data variable will be called now print df print df we are calling the object this is the now the total these two lists will be converted into what series series means i told you that in panda series means like a column calories is a column series here columns are called series calories is a series duration is a series every list converted means are they converted into a converted into what it is converted into a series series means column see let us see how to correct how to practice this code here try to understand what happened i told import is compulsory why import import means we need to import pandas library okay because if you want to work with data okay to analyze the data i told you that pandas will be used to work with to analyze the data okay so here i told you that any unique name my name you keep your name you keep no issue pandas has vasu this is a variable means this data set two lists declared in a as a set in flower braces now it is called data set that we need to keep a name x there is no any problem anything this is a variable now this data set means this two lists declared in a as a set it is called data set assign to a variable x is equal to something okay now we need to create a object so load data into a data frame object now this data stored in x variable now it will be loaded into your object object is created for data frame so that object name data frame df simply you can keep your name why name why no issue no pd dot pd is what pandas nickname but i have changed vasu so you change this any nickname for alias name for your 
pandas now data set assigned to x variable now the data loaded into an object y now wasu dot data frame in bracket we need to call that data set name now data set name is what x okay now print df df is what dar object here object i have changed the object name as y so call the y now run this code you are getting error why because let us see see here is indentation error it is what indentation error marking at y indentation error is what i told you that in previous python classes maine bataya tha python previous classes mein maine bataya tha ki indentation matlab margin error okay margin at which line at y now margin now adjust this y to near to x line x is a variable that variable assigned to a data set now y is a object created for this data frame okay load into a data frame object now run this code now see two series we are getting two series two series means i told you that series is nothing but it is like a column of a table okay 0 1 2 they are the zero line row one row two row 0 1 2 are the labels here indexes because we have not used any labels in the previous class i told you that how to create the labels for any uh, indexes okay i have not used here maine either label system al nahi kiya isliye 0 1 2 indexes hi labels maan ke chale gaye idhar theek hai so samajh mein aaya calories you can change this calories any name you can keep your say 420380 this is the data you can change the data but name any name you keep yourself um marks okay Mm, this is duration you change this as anything you can keep but double quotation marks huh? marks huh? duration 420380 marks so change this as english okay otherwise english otherwise uh, any topic uh, computer science computer science sc okay this is what this uh, this column this list name is what practical okay practical that is computer science theory computer theory th theory marks okay this is practical practicals okay now run this code you are getting like what you know we are getting error why you new know, syntax error invalid character in identifier where computer theory okay why because see this variable whenever whatever we are creating variable there is no any gap this gap will not be accessed accepted for a variable okay now kept hyphen or underscore okay now it is okay that is the reason huh? but still it giving error syntax error invalid character in identifier okay computer theory okay Okay, no issue, no issue. Practical. This is what. Hmm. 
giving error huh? you need to handle this error first see here I have changed this um, name a uh, calories name as computer okay now this uh, duration name as practical okay this is what list name it's nothing but practical okay practical now see what happened this list name change it to calories name change it to computer practical means list name you can keep any name doesn't mean okay there is no any quick problem nahi hoga aapka आप लिस्ट का नेम कोई भी चेंज कर सकते हो आप कोई प्रॉब्लम नहीं है आपने इसको कंप्यूटर लिख दिया है दूसरा इसको प्रैक्टिकल लिख दिया कोई प्रॉब्लम नहीं कुछ भी लिख सकते हो लिस्ट का नाम आपका मर्जी वट यू वांट टू कीप लिस्ट नेम प्रैक्टिकल ओके नो रन दिस कोड see what happened here you are getting error no issue adjust this uh, name okay or run this code you are getting this okay see i have changed the name of uh, that what is that that list name as computer initial it was uh, calories and the second one was so i have changed that moment if it is giving any error so adjust that that may be some little bit uh, indentation errors okay margin errors huh? now you are getting your what computer practical you can change anything if yeah. you can keep your name rahul rahul getting rahul practical marks what do you mean rahul practical marks okay rahul practical so it's very simple to do in pandas pandas is a library as i told you that part of your python mostly use it for your to analyze the data okay data science is a part of your python okay data science okay so do deal with data science to analyze the data pandas library are there so many libraries i told you that different for different purposes if you want to do work with web development django is there hmm Uh, numerical numerical python numpy is there okay like that okay so very simple huh? now let us go for next class